back to the boat, back to the crossroads. All right, over here to the circle in the middle of the crossroads, which is hay already, you know, sectioned out. This must be the center of the crossroads. Yep, yes it is. So, the first thing we needed was a guide. Well, we have a guide dog. Boop. Something to find your way. Check. <laughs> Sit. Stay. Good, good dog. Alrighty, next we need an anchor, which, hey, that kind of, you know, explains itself. Anchors away. Check. Alrighty, and next we need some courage. Well, we have some liquid courage. One bottle of liquid courage. Check. Okay. All I need is a sacrifice in my name. Where the heck am I supposed to find that? Yeah, that's the, you know, not as good one. Back over to boat. And now we'll go talk to Miss Morgan. Doo -doo, to the sword fight. All right, up the mast. Run, Garbrush, run. You're so slow. Up, up, up. He shimmies up that thing pretty easily. All right, Morgan. Hey, I got something. What's up? I found a spell. I found a spell that will let me return <laughs> to the land of the living. Yay. Really? That's great. How do we use it? First, I need to gather a bunch of ingredients, but I'm having some trouble figuring out what they're supposed to be. Maybe you can help me. Maybe. What are the items? Well, the only thing I need left is a sacrifice. The spell requires a sacrifice made to me. That sounds pretty complicated. Maybe you should focus on the other ingredients first. Alrighty, do it. Good idea. Alrighty, that's enough for now. Uh, let's see. Do, 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 do. Uh, I still need hey, some Mo, kind of sacrifice. I still need one more thing for the crossroads spell. Which? Some kind of sacrifice. I can't find it anywhere. Yeah, I've been thinking about that. I think I have an idea. Come on, I'll show you. Mm. This is kind of sad. I'm the only one on the boat. Where'd she come from? Okay, where's this sacrifice? I, I don't see anything. Right here. No! Whoa, whoa! whoa. That's your shred that, of life! Is that a good idea? What? No, no, this is just my reputation. I can easily build that back up again. Well... Oh, I completely okay. forgot to mention, one of the things in my inventory is a shred of life, which I'm hanging on to as hard as I can. She was hanging on to her reputation. Right. Thank you. He's a good friend. Don't just stand there. Get Down that is, she wants to be more. Of course. But, you know, that, that ain't gonna Wait, happen. I don't know what else I'm... <clears throat> yeah, that was easy. <laughs> well, I guess this is it. Yeah. Seems safe enough. Who's <coughs> first? Hey. Ouch. Huh. That's weird. I can go through no problem. Mm, oh, heck no. I am not getting stuck in this afterlife. So, what are you going to do? I don't know. You just go on through and take care of your business. I'll figure it out. Good luck with that, Bo. Wish me luck. And he has such a clutch. Clutch? Clutch. Clutch. He's such a clutch. Yeah. Alrighty, loading again, loading again, and we come back into the world, which is looking a little more dreary than we remember. Ugh. Looks like someone's been causing some uh, chaos. Hey, it's a crossroads. <laughs> Why won't this thing open? Elaine, get over here and help me. I spent months getting those mangy voodoo cursed monkeys into place so I could conjure up the entrance to the crossroads. I won't be thwarted now. Yeah, up yours, little Chuck. Oh, come oh, on. Why is she I going along spirit, with this? Not your back. Get over here and push. You know, you did that to actually kill him. And why not? Do you know the number of times that bony buccaneer has killed me? No. A lot. <laughs> Let you, catch you know, good on us. Stupid nice guy act because 
because I thought that it would get Guybrush to realize that the voodoo lady was... Do not mention that woman in my presence. That cursed voodoo witch will control my fate no more. Now that I have La Esponja Grande, I can use it to suck pure, unlimited voodoo energy directly into yeah, the source. Yeah, a big sponge. I will become the demon pirate god, and you will be my goddess. And this time, there will be no Guybrush Threepwood to spoil our wedding plans. And <laughs> in comes Guybrush. What was that? Yes, that's it. And he pulses it in. Uh, that's not good. Whoa. Uh, yeah, he's looking quite a bit more demonic. Oh, yeah, with the spikes. Why do they always put spikes? Well, he's Wait, always been a bit of a sporty git. Guybrush? Sweetie! I'll tell you what's going on here. Hey, I'm a ghost. Those are swords. Physical swords. You expect them to hurt me? <laughs> to the unlimited voodoo power of the crossroads themselves. This is my moment of ultimate triumph. So, ghost of Guybrush Threepwood, would you like to RSVP for the wedding now or later? Uh, you won't get away with this, LeChuck. You won't get away with this, LeChuck. Whatever it is you're doing, I've opened the crossroads themselves to stop you. You opened the crossroads. <laughs> then I suppose I have to hey. thank you for doing my bidding hey. for a second time. Yeah. Why? I'm always helping him for some reason. So you admit I'm better than you. Yes, you needed me. Ha -ha. Well, you admit. I am better than you. You are the only living soul that can do that, uh, you know. Puzzle solving. Mm -hmm. Boy, was my face red when La Esponja Grande turned out to be so small. But then you took right care of that, didn't you? <laughs> when did that trick me? The voodoo lady gave me the making spell. Uh, she gave me the... Voodoo she did all that. Voodoo lady? By the way, does anyone know if she has a name? It feels weird just calling her. And he's just voodoo up and down lady. and up and down. She's the voodoo lady. I'll be taking care of her soon too. <laughs> the cutlass of Kaflu. I have infused the cutlass of Kaflu with demonic power that no mortal can touch. Hmm. This weapon that was designed to destroy you know, she's second or something. ultimately set me free. But is it good or is it, it bad? To slay the woman who has locked you and I in this perpetual loop of fate. Isn't that right, Elaine? Hey, you're the only one yes. insisting on coming back. And hey. we shall slay her together. Hey. Making you know, I know this is part of her bride. plan, but still, what? hey. My demon bride kind of gets you all choked up in here, doesn't it? Yeah, because I want to barf. The Chuck has more power than any pirate could possibly dream of. And besides, you're dead now. That doesn't have anything to do with so it. So is he. Yeah, we're I'm both sorry, dead. sorry, Guybrush. No! No! Oh god, what's he doing to her? Oh, ew. Wonder Bunny. Ugh. No! Ooh, she's getting a makeover. <laughs> I don't like that, huh? Alright, can I go? Are, ghost of Guybrush Threepwood, <coughs> trying to interfere with my big moment with Elaine once again. Well, come on and stop me. Give it your best stab. Alright, I will. Grab the cutlass. Ha ha. Prepare to meet your... Oh, come oh, on. Oh, God. Mm. Why can't I grab anything? That's just one of the side effects of being a fleshless specter. Good thing you are, though. Just one slice of that re-enchanted blade is enough to destroy anything it touches in this mortal world. But okay, that was kind of creepy. To save you and kill a chuck again. Again, it ain't so easy being a ghost now, is it, Mr. Freepwood? Well. 
That's how I felt all those years ago when I was a simple ghost pirate. You had some physical physicality to you, though. And now, you I mean, heck, you punched me to the moon. My spiritual essence to shreds when you doused me with that ghost destroying voodoo root beer. Uh, uh -oh. let's not be hasty. It felt yeah. a lot uh -oh. like uh -oh. oh, God. Uh -oh. Oh, God. <laughs> you don't have to act so quite as well, Elaine. 